let me tell you, um, negative internal voice is almost valueless for you. Trench's behavior. Both been acting odd. Yes, because one got possessed by the bad thing. Uh, the only time being negative internally when referring to yourself is valuable is if it's a growth moment and it's like to spur some kind of change. Like, I do not like this detail about myself, I'm not so, doing so I'm hard. going to change You're it. Fine. Or I'm going we'll to do this. this. Or I'm going to do that. The ones doing the Just kicking dog. yourself in the guts for no gain. Uh, there's you get nothing from that. You lose from that, but you don't gain. Ranger from squad it. Charlie Seven returned from an expedition into the quarry threshold just after zero five hundred Zulu. Can you please state your names and describe the purpose of your expedition? Kevin Horowitz, Rupert Well. Our mission was to map quarry grid coordinates G twenty nine. Secondary objective, as always, each was to hits. find a route we from the threshold to station ASAP. I'm trying well, to listen to this tape. To Shut up. Objective yeah. was not They're going to have to be. We are moving out and, I am not even and did you encounter any previously unrecorded event or entity while inside the threshold? No, nothing. Do you think we should tell him about the mermaid? Excuse me? Yeah, the mermaid. Horowitz here found this mermaid in the quarry just sitting on some black rock. She was singing this beautiful song and he was overcome with desire. Deal. You kill a hit, oh, she was I so alluring. Shot. I'd say she was more enchanting than alluring. Fine, enchanting. Um, did you tell your CO about this? No. Because it didn't happen. Nothing happened. As usual, the quarry is full of rocks. That's it. Can we go now? <laughs> Fuck you guys. Get out of here. Oh, that was worthless. Just like being negative to yourself. And it, in a way, being overly negative and and like holding yourself to like a lower standard of expectation, even of yourself. It's toxic beyond the obvious way of being a detriment. It's also like in a way excusing your behavior, right? Like if there's something you don't like about yourself, rather than talk about it like it's an inevitable character flaw as opposed to like something to work on. Like, you know what I mean? Like when you say, oh, I'm a piece of shit, you're kind of giving yourself permission to be that piece of shit, right? You're like, you're saying it as though it's an immutable thing about you, but it's not. You could stop being a piece of shit literally at any time. And you probably should. What's over here? You should also ready for people who are pieces of shit to not stop being pieces of shit. Like, what I'm talking about is, like, a personal responsibility thing. Like, don't don't hitch your wagon to someone else that's a piece of shit on the hope that they're going to change. It'd be great if they did, but, you Arish know, wasn't kidding about that monster. It'll fucking suck for you if it doesn't. That's, uh, that's the hard sub-lesson that I've taken forever to fucking learn, and I'm not 100% confident that I'm there yet, you know? Like, investing in the wrong people can be so destructive. You showed me the HRA when I first got here. And the machine that makes them. Can you help me find a prism? And, like, the worst part about it is, like, when you're investing in people for, like, a good reason or because you're a good person, it's not that, uh, that you are less of a good person, it's just more like your good nature is harming you, which is very counterintuitive, and I think it's difficult for a good person to perceive as fully as it is real. You know? Now I'm being as fucking weird as this game. What is this? Shit! They're shattered! Not a single prism left. At her. What the fuck? What up, bro? Come on, man. I can't see you. You windy bitch. Let's try, though. Motherfucker. 
I'm not throwing my thing at him. That's not good. Now I don't see him. Definitely gonna lose to this thing. Unless there's a health item. I have one fucking health. Well, I thought I saw where it was, but I guess not. This thing almost dead, it's almost dead too. got literally one health like me. Am I regenerating health just crazy slow? Come on. Got him. Bitch. Let's hurry up and find Darling's lab. Oh, that was my throw bar that was low health, of course. Boo. I feel like I've talked about all this shit before, and I'll probably talk about it again just because I think about it all the time. And I also forget what I say in these recordings. Because I record once every eight fucking house. months. We're under the right conditions. When the frequencies match, other dimensions leak in. We call these areas thresholds. The quarry is one of the more stable thresholds in the maintenance sector. That's, that's where Black Rock comes from. You heard Extra that too, right? Dimensional matter. Black rock comes from the a threshold. Ari. Frequencies, a, a so good thing. the prisms must be there too. Contained. Think of it as key. Paranatural lead. This should get us into the quarry. Our research involves many dangerous things we absolutely need to keep in check. That's what the Black Rock line firebreaks are about. The panopticon container cells. Uh, sorry to interrupt, sir, but I need the code for the quarry elevator. Oh, uh, Emily, the codes, Blackrock 665. Neighbor of the Beast? Neighbor of the Beast. Haha, <laughs> it's a Max Payne yeah. reference. <laughs> we can do that ag again if you... Oh, I thought that button was going to turn the TV off. I apologize. See, I'm a gamer. I remember things. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Yes, yes. Don't don't bonk at me, motherfucker. I got a level five access card. Everything here is crazy. Weird, but it feels right. Like how the world should be. Huh? I am in an infinite building leading to different dimensions and I never want to leave. Well, that makes Even one with of us. all the horror, I'm happy. Wonderful. It feels sane. Combat. Just the right kind of insane. Put that on my dating profile. LOL. Can you hit with any of these bullets, please? Come on, man. What's over here? Is there anything over here? Yes. Whatever that is. Ah, a ritual impulse. Okay. Now I want to go the other way. Safe point over there. Well, look at that. <coughs> oh. Throw 
coffee machine at your bitch ass. <laughs> Fan death. Electric fans operate at speeds that may suffocate users by overly disturbing the air. <laughs> I do like the premise of this game, which is the universe is fucking weird, and you need an organization to, like, manage it. It's very, uh, very Laundry Files-esque which is a book series I highly recommend, even though I've only read two of them. But I really liked both of them a lot. It's very similar, although this that one is a lot more um, fun and um, sarcastic than this game is. But it's fine. It's its own thing. Health recovery. Yes, please. What, what does this do? Damage while low on health. It's not exactly what I wanted. You know what? Fuck it. We'll put it in there, though. Damage against enemy armor. Just for reload speed, that sucks. I really need health item related things. Whatever, who cares? Let's just turn this down to bitch difficulty because that'll make the game easier. Does this have a bitch difficulty? <laughs> it doesn't. <laughs> I don't see a difficulty thing here at all. Alright, I guess I'll go fuck myself. Interface. Subtitles. Oh boy. Oh boy. Well. Elevator's broken. Guess I'll just have to get good. Gotta get down the old fashioned way. What, just jumping down? I'll do that. I'll jump off a motherfucking cliff. I don't give a fuck. Oh no, that was almost quite bad. Oh, I forgot those ones explode. Whoops. Have I made an OSHA joke in this video yet? This place is up to code, lol. <laughs> I 
thank God these handrails stop so I don't have to jump over. Exploding ass bitch. It's almost like you're supposed to go this way. Oh boy. Alright. Seems a bit steep. So I'm gonna step off down there. Hopefully not die. I almost died. leave probably fix the elevator now too that that hits them like the margin of error for it is very forgiving I just really wish this game were more linear so I could focus on the narrative instead of being lost in this just endless fucking abyss. That's just personal preference though, I'm sure people love this game. Additional diamond blades. battle music. Are we good? Are we actually not in combat? This is exactly the kind of platforming I do not like. If I miss this ledge, you're about to hear me say fuck a lot. Not what I expected. orange and I click, it should be a hit. Okay. Here 
rotating him out. Die, please. Fucking hell. I know there's another one over there. Don't have a fucking bomb puzzle. Please just be a button I press and the bombs explode. Oh, well, we look like we need. That's well, kind of a bomb puzzle. <laughs> That's not the worst. Could be worse. We just need the last. Whatever. Battery cube. don't know where it is. So that's fine. Just wander aimlessly. Is that it over there? Climb, you fuck. Incident. Crew in state of blank. Take that, thank you. And there it is, right where you led me. The HRAs, the well, prisms, they mean something They're playing something combat to music. I need to get this prism to Marshall before it's too late. That's probably not good. HRAs, then Dylan. Oh good, that thing. That's what I want to deal with right now. Oh good, it's chasing me over here. Nice. Oh, there's two of them, even better. Supposed to go to the elevator, I bet. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. Up the stairs, up the stairs. They probably don't corner well. That's not where I'm going either. Seems precarious, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not exactly sure I'm on the right track here. I think this is the right way. 
Yes. How the fuck do I get up there, though? This way? Looks like now. I don't get up there. If those things have a way to get to me, I'm gonna be very upset. Okay. Don't actually see a path up to there, so I guess I am going there. I will go fuck myself. Stop. Stop. Okay, never mind. Don't know what that note says, because it opened the wrong thing and refused to open the right thing, so I guess I'll go fuck myself. How many of these fucking things are there? Trying to get to Central Executive. Oh, shit. Ugh. All right, where am I going? Am I going this it's way? It's ridiculous. Pope's grasping at straws. Why? If this is a frequency, then why couldn't they find like I'm not going that way. It would explain the hair loss. Think about it. The precision that would require is unthinkable. Had to take a detour into the quarry, but I found plenty. Here. We will start HRA production immediately. I promised I'd tell you about Dylan once you helped us. But I won't. This is it. She knows. Seventeen years I've waited. Mm. Your brother is here. He was once known as Prime Candidate Six, codename P6. We brought him here after the ordinary event. He was groomed to be the future director. He had talents far beyond any other candidate in the program. Of course he did. We found you together. We share a bond. Are you with him now? So you kidnapped him. We took him in. Your parents vanished along with every other adult in Ordinary. Eventually, his power changed him. There were casualties. Mm. He wasn't fit to be the director. Did you know about this? Is this why you didn't bring me here sooner? Were you keeping me away? Where is Dylan? He's kept in the containment sector, in the Panopticon. My brother... 
I thought we were the same. What if we are? I'm going. Now. I expected as much. I need to go check on something. Something I cannot let the Hiss find. It shouldn't okay. take long, but you must watch the Bureau while I'm gone. That's what I've been doing this whole and time. And remember, Dylan is dangerous. Do not let him out, Director Faden. How do I make her stop calling me that? I'm not here for them. Nothing simple here. These people took my brother, but they've accepted me without question. Are they my enemies, or my friends? I need to see Dylan. I need to know. I wish you could tell me what you know, explain things. Just stay with me, okay? I could use a friend right now. Everything costs three, lol. Cool. Outfits. Oh, okay, cool. Let's go find Dylan. In containment. Where's the fucking elevator? I think it's this way. Hope wants us to compile all Welcome of Dark's back. data entries from the past month. She wants us to crack Dark. Containment. I think we're gonna get to Dylan and then call it a video because my brain is kind of fried. If you couldn't tell. Containment sector. Panopticon. Altered items. Maximum security prison. Dangerous. didn't go too bad. I'm starting to get a bit of a rhythm. Let's 
still don't know where I'm going, though. if there's any fun names on this wall. through the medical wing, looks like. What's this? Ah, uh, too low level. enough. on through, boys. I 
I did a tremendous amount of damage. Fuck you, guy. It is. Hmm. Eh, seems fine. is what the Bureau calls Dylan. His cell's been breached. Has the Hiss found him? Are you there with him? Can you protect him? Excellent. Shouldn't touch it. Do, 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 do. I mean, just wandering around in endless bureaucracy. I think this game is actually my hell in terms of setting. It's a government building that never ends. Should not have to do this. go back to the fucking hotel blue hotel
We are not good. I see that now. Okay. Just an upside down room. Well, look at that. We did it's been it again. It's a long time since Dylan and I knew each other. I've wondered about him. What kind of man he'd grow up to be. A prisoner. If things as hard for him as they were for me. Maybe in here, they were even harder. Speed with head Opticon supervisor. Look at this fucking guy. Oh, hello. Is there something I can help you with? I'm Jesse, the new director. I need to get inside. New director? Right, uh, well, okay, hello, I'm Frederick Langston, the Panopticon supervisor. It's not the best time for a tour. We have hiss everywhere, numerous cell breaches, and system failures across the board, but you're the director, so here we go. Founded by Zachariah Trench, the Panopticon is our state-of-the-art repository for all altered I items. I don't have time for this. Power and I was told Dylan Faden was kept here. Can you help me find him? Faden. Uh, sure. Darling wanted him somewhere secure and isolated away from people. He's in the maximum security cells, upper level. But there's currently a, uh, a pressing matter, ma'am. We've got an object of power loose in there. <laughs> it's wrecking the place. The Benikoff TV? It's, uh, it's a real doozy. Salvador took a team in to handle it, but no one's heard from them for hours. This is a Category 5 OOP we're talking about, and if we don't contain it soon, it will tear the Panopticon apart. And we don't want all those altered items getting loose, ma'am. No, trust me. Dylan's in there. Open the door, Langston. I'll handle it. If you say so. Uh, I usually tell first-timers not to touch it in, so uh, just do that. Okay. Here, I'll get the door for you. And please, ma'am, call me Fred. Thanks, Langston. Huh. What's up, boys? Some of the security cameras aren't working. How do I get those fixed? Maintenance staff will repair any damaged systems once normal operations. The Panopticon. Oh. Dylan's close. But that object of power might wreck this place before I find him. Proceed. I enjoy more than perfunctory combat. say the 
Penalty items being locked in prison is kind of funny. We're looking for the fifth floor. Something went wrong with the Bureau's plan to make Dylan the next director. Marshall made it sound like it was all Dylan's fault, but how much of it was what the Bureau yeah, did to him? By the bad residents. I don't think she's telling me everything. Trapped with the fridge. What are you doing in there? Oh, thank God. Look, someone has to watch this object at all times or it deviates. My shipper blazer never showed up. Can you help me? Damn. No. I can't. I'm sorry. There's an emergency. I'll come back. I promise. Okay. Okay. Just don't forget. I can't stare at this thing much longer. Fridge duty. Sorry, bro. Flying into the fucking abyss. It's okay, I don't need it. Good, bro. Probably should be dead. Not good. That's the object of power. I need to cleanse it. Be cleansed. Spooky television. <sighs> well, that's not good. Chasing it that way. Oh, 
Okay then. guy they were talking about. Hell. Or the head of security. We need the head of shit now. A chance against the hiss. No one here does. That's a spirit. Okay. The TV. Another object of power gone nuts. Here we go again. Be cleansed. <laughs> Levitate superhero over the obstacle. Okay. Oh, that's cool. Like a floaty double jump. One out, bitch. Man, okay, dealt with the TV. Now I can find Dylan.
I hit space bar to, to float. I guess I ran out of float. Okay. Sure, why not? Well, note to self. Don't try to fly in combat. Not like that anyway. Don't tell me I have to do all that again. Okay, thank fucking God. <laughs> that would have made me very upset. Go that way. Fly that way? No. This is where I just came from, is it not? Yeah. Okay. This is how we get up. Am I correct? I could Dylan. help you, pal. He's so close. Flashlight would be nice. Can you hear me? Jesse. Are you talking on the phone? <laughs> and ain't, ain't answering that phone. Emily? He's gone. Dylan isn't here. He might be nearby. Or maybe the hiss got to him. I don't know. Jesse, listen. Dylan's here. With us. He just walked in. He says he is giving himself up. He's been affected by the hiss, but, but he is different than the others. We must isolate him. I'm on my way. Just missed each we other, LOL. I have to see <coughs> my brother. About this item on the floor. Hmm. Oh, you don't hold it, you tap it. Okay, that's what I fucked up. So watch, I'll show you what I mean. Hovering, right? You drop in, tap. 
see, and I was holding. And then I was holding, holding, holding. That still worked for some reason. Maybe it is when you get struck. I don't know. Who knows? <laughs> Uh. Alright, that was dumb. That was almost killed me. Is there a circle or something I can use to get the fuck out of here? Uh, sad little room. Probably panicked. Up the stairs, please. Hmm. Well, I guess I'm backtracking. That doesn't feel very... Doesn't feel correct. Look at that high-res exit sign. Incredible. Boom. I imagine if the brother isn't hostile, then he's going to give us a lore dump, which is probably good for the recording to end on. But first... More health. make spin. That could be fun. Let's give that a spin. <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, that's fun. I don't know if it's good. It's probably not good. But it's fun. prisoner they captured is the director of the Jukebox token. I found this token. Any idea what it does? Uh, that is a jukebox token. Little bastards turn up in the weirdest places. Like bad pennies. Oh good, a the collectible. Rangers use them to activate an old object of power. A jukebox, I assume. Does it have any good songs? Nope, just the one record. Hey, be careful turning it on, though. When it's playing, you get a free trip to the formation. The formation? That sounds ominous. Why does it send you there? A 
But the Bureau has been wondering that for years. How about what is that? I mean, it's just a pile of rocks built by God knows Thanks. who. Thanks. Well, researchers have confirmed it's in the same threshold as the quarry. Well, no one's ever been able to map a physical route to the formation for maintenance. So it's in the quarry. You just don't know where. Pretty much. But if I go back, we only send in annual now, expeditions to the there. formation now. Checkups, Salvador calls them. Salvador doesn't this call This year's team went now. in the day the hiss arrived. But come to think of it, the song should have rolled back hours ago. I can go in and take a look. I'd appreciate that. The jukebox is kept just past the security booth over there. Just put in the token and enjoy the ride. I have to go. Me too. You're not the only one who's busy, you know. Executive affairs. They up here, I don't remember. Utility. That's cute. Hello? This way? Marshall abandons us. I'm sick of no one telling us what's going on. Oh, I can't use my flying power. How sad. Is it this way? Doesn't seem like it. Fuck are you idiots? Sector elevator? Doubt it. Hello? Ah. Surely we're going this way. Yes. The resonance emitted from the HRAs is purely antithetical to every variant of the His signal I can array. No, Where's my happening. brother? After all these years, Dylan is here. You son of a bitch. But am I too late? How is he? See, I, I need had to know. pushing too many pencils. He's clearly been affected by the His, but it's different than any other manifestation we've recorded. Maybe what makes you so special is genetic. He was a prime candidate. Or maybe it's Polaris protecting him, something else affecting the situation. I need to run tests. He seems more in control, more present. I want to see him. My brother. Or is he? Of course. Now, Marshall set up an HRA warded cage to contain him. It's on the upper floor, up the stairs. Oh, God, okay, I need to go. Why can't he Jesse, just be in here? Be careful. Or take me there in the cutscene. Come on. All these fucking lore items. I don't want to touch them. The resonance emitted from the HRAs is purely antithetical to every variant of the hissing like the said upstairs. Oh my god, did she have to write everything in her made up gibberish code? Fucking Marshall. Oh. God. Well, we already know he's not up here, so what the fuck are they talking about? Or at least not the here that we brought walked through. Maybe over here. The director restored HRA production. They're already getting other survivors right. out of safe rooms. Great. Maybe I can get back to my office soon. Marshall orders us to just sit on our asses and then leaves? I oh, deal. this room looks like hell. Then she should have taken us with her. I need some action, goddammit. Okay, well. Did you see that hiss they marched through here? Why the fuck did we put a bullet in that thing's head? Good question. Where? 
help me help myself, please. Don't know where I'm going. I feel like it's not this way. Can we at least get the peel it people off the ceiling in the like cleansed areas? Some big shoes to fill. Not that way. This way? Yes. The thunders hold us. You are a through time. Oh, God. The thunders hold us still at zero. Happiness comes. White pearls, but yellow and red in the eye. Through a mirror, inverted is made right. Leave your insides by the door. Push the thing through the surface into the wet. You've always been a new youth. Why this is betrayal? We stand around you while you dream. You can almost hear our words, but you forget. Through time, the thunder's home you distorts good, bro? you. Happiness comes. You are a warm through time. Shit. The thunder's home distorts you. That's Happiness Dylan. Comes. White pearls can you hear me? Red in the eye. Oh, come on, Dylan. Dylan. I'm here. By the door. I found you. The surface into the wet. You've always been a new youth. Do you know who I am? Oh, you know me. Say it. You are Dylan Faden's sister. He's talking in the third person. Always a good sign. Do you know who you are? Not Dylan. Trench and Darling made sure of that. I'm P6. P6. But I'm better now. The hiss made me better. Push the fingers through the surface into the wet. You've always been the new you. You want this Please to stop be that. Please. <sighs> Not exactly the reunion I'd hoped for. It feels good to say those words. I want to say them. They sound good. They make me feel good. Don't you want to say them too? No. Fuck off, no. You need to help me get this thing out of his head. If he is still in there, if there is anything left, you have to you. help me. You! You came in through the hole in you. We let you in. You've always been here. The only true of a copy of a copy of a copy of a copy. Stop it! Orange peel! Shit! Shit! He can see you. This is not safe. We found Polaris together with my sister when we were very small, in ordinary, in the desert, through the door opened up by the slide projector. But she didn't help when Trunch took me away. She didn't give me any powers. All the powers are my own powers. <laughs> she didn't help when they locked me up for years. After the song time for applause, we build you till nothing remains. The air cracks and the truth will emerge out of you. You are home. The Bureau brought the slide projector back here with me. And the Bureau did what the Bureau does. They used it, and they found... They opened the door up to the hiss. That's the only thing I can thank them for. There. There it is. We stopped the Altered World event in Ordinary when we shut down the slide projector. And now the projector's here. I near warm as a tune you can't stop humming in a dream. Baby, 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 yeah. Just plastic. So safe. Nothing to worry about. <laughs> Funny. I welcomed the hiss. I let it in.
to get rid of her. The hiss set me free. Polaris is using you. The Bureau is using you. You are a puppet. You can almost hear our words, but you forget. If we shut this off the slide world. projector, maybe, maybe that will stop the hiss. Maybe it's not too late for my brother. You must see the truth for yeah, yourself, Jesse. Fixable. Sister, the horrible truth about the Bureau. The hiss is the better option. Go to the prime candidate program in the containment sector. I have the key card to get you there. Salvador wanted me to have it. Wanted? Bullshit. I saw what the hiss did to Salvador. What it turned him into. Okay, Dylan. Yeah, I gave him a file cabinet for a head. I want to see the truth for myself. I'll go. But only to look for this lie projector. You can help me. We can end this. You are a worm through time. You are a worm through time. The thunder's hum distorts you. Happiness comes with white pearls, but yellow and red in the eye. Through a mirror of the end. Hell yeah, level six card. Complete psycho babble. Why have you dissected that freak mutation we locked up? I think this is a good place to save. That's a thing I can do in this game. It's not. And call it a video. Go fuck yourself.